She had love for all. She had compassion for the less fortunate. She had a passion for what she did. Cooking, sewing, planted straws. And when it came down to cooking, me personally, I enjoyed a sheep town sauce. Now Tanya could attest to this. One time we had a little get together at Tadashi's home. And God forgive me, I had four bowls. <laughs> but that's how good it was. She also had a servant heart. Her hospitality was something to be desired. As you go through this time of bereavement, my prayer for you is that God will remove the spirit of heaviness, loneliness, sadness, distress, anger, and pain. We pray that he will replace it with the peace, the peace that surpasses all understanding. May the joy of the Lord be your portion this day. And to the kids, especially my dear sister in law Tanya, I say to you this afternoon it is okay to cry. In John 11 and 35, it says that Jesus wept at the tomb of his friend Lazarus. So it's okay to cry. Submit yourself to the Lord, and he will direct your path. In 1 Peter 5 and 7, it says, Cast all your cares upon him, for he cared for you. Amen. And I trust the words of this short poem bring you comfort as you mourn the passing of your loved one. She's in the sun, the wind, the rain. She's in the air you breathe, every breath you take. She sings a song of hope and cheer. There's no more pain, no more fear. You'll see her in the clouds above. Hear her whisper words of love. You'll be together before long, until then. Listen for a song. My hope is built on nothing less than Jesus' blood and righteousness. I dare not trust the sweetest friend, but holy name on 